Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The People's National Party has indicated that it will not participate in the political debates in the current format where journalists pose questions to its leaders. Instead, the PNP wants a town hall format similar to what happens in the U.S. It's also demanding an apology from the opposition leader, Andrew Holness. And Mr. Holness says he is ready to defend a claim by Prime Minister Portia Simpson Miller that he defamed her. Simpson Miller has written to Mr. Holness demanding that he apologizes by Saturday or face legal action. In the meantime, the Private Sector Organization of Jamaica is asking its members to disclose their donations to political parties. The operator of the Madden's Funeral Palo has revealed that almost all of the 25 bodies were decomposed when they were taken to his business place by police and soldiers one day after the start of the May 2010 Tivoli Gardens operations. Ferdinand Madden testified before the West Kingston Commission of Inquiry that some of the bodies were in an advanced state of decomposition. Matthew Sewell, the Jamaican man suing the Bahamian government for wrongful imprisonment, has reportedly received glass fragments in his meal at the correctional facility where he is being held. Swell says he's now afraid to eat in Bahamian jail. In your weather forecast, on Friday morning there will be showers mainly across northern and southeastern parishes. In the afternoon there will be widely scattered showers spread across to southern parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.